In my first video, I talked about how to write or prepare a research article. This is very, very important. So the basic tips were first you need to find research gap. This is the same like your research proposal and you need to know about the previous knowledge from there you will find the gap research gap or problem statement after that you need to purchase your chemicals this is the second step the third step to start your synthesis synthesis part mean making synthesis mean making to make something you are making you know particle quantum numbers whatever after that you need characterizations to characterize your nanoparticles whether are you getting the desired particles or not are you getting the desired material or not after that you need to make device because the ultimate target is designing because you are doing phd or master this is the highest level of bloom's taxonomy so you must need to design or create something so this is the device publication part and the last one is the, the sixth one is result discussion you need to write the main main things and link this to the previous knowledge that what the other people got and what you are getting here you just compare you know when you are depending your phd or master you must need to do comparison because comparison is very important you need to tell the audience that how other people got this result and how i got in why my result is better in why my result is enhanced what were the reason so this is you need to put these kind of things and finally conclude conclude your all stuff let's go to the real scenario how i prepare my manuscript this is my manuscript here my research article this is the title and we will talk about abstract later we always write abstract at the end abstract so this is the introduction part now this is the literature review part this is the background i'm talking about people work here you see i'm talking about oregon and gradle 1991 paper i have you reference one you see small reference here and when you click here it will it will show you information you see oregon uh, 1991 uh, you see this is uh, i am i'm using people work i am just talking about previous knowledge similarly here you see this is the literature part from here i got the problem you see all these information i am talking about the background the literature survey the literature review this is my uh, introduction here in the paper you see here i talked about all these problems you see a strategy i am talking about in my in introduction you see i am talking about uh, what will be the strategy here you see so this is my part here now you see here this is all the previous knowledge i am talking about from the literature you see here now my part is here we have fabricated a composite photo you note up this in this you see here and briefly i told that we have fabricated this uh, and uh, and we got this kind of result you see here it mentioned here you see so this is the first part and that is the background you see now the experimental part is here you see i'm talking about now the synthesis part you see in here you need to talk about the synthesis and characterizations how you done that uh, you need to write here that i prepare this molar solution this and this was the uh, i use electro spinning and what was what were the parameters here you see this is that part here so the synthesis and characterization i put combined here but all these things i will explain in the um, uh, result discussion also in detail you see then how i then fabricate electrode here this is also in synthesis part because you are making something and then fabrication and testing of device you see here then we this is also in synthesis part i'm sorry because you are making something here so this is in synthesis part here in result discussion we will elaborate these things in detail here okay this is all about here uh, now it's come to the result discussion part here you see now here i am just uh, telling the thing in a uh, detail and i am discussing all these things you see so here i will use diagram this is uh, a cm images here you see from here i can tell the people that what the images look like here and 
this is the cross-sectional view of my electrojuicy. I told that we will also need characterization when we fabricate a device. When we make electrode, these are the cross-section of my electrodes here. You see here, these are my cross-sections. So I am also, you can see the cross-section here and you can find the thickness from this uh, cross-section that how thick my layer is, whether it is in micron or nano cell size. You see, this is all about the uh, result discussion. Then after that, I am just talking about the uh, crystallinity using XRD. You see, this is I am also talking about. So all these discussion, discussion means discussion. It will be under the result discussion part. Discussion, you see, this is diluting. Diluting, I choose five, one, two, three, four, five. Five type of electrodes. This is the diluting that which electrode uh, 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 anchor more dye. So you can see this, <laughs> the yellow one, the P25, because it has a large surface area, you see. And the red one, when we did the concentration of TiCl4 more, uh, so uh, this is higher, you see. This is the pure one, the below one, the black, it has a low diluting, you see. So this is, this is other, uh, this is the uh, IV measurement here. All these measurement under, come under the uh, result and discussion. You see, this is all dis result and discussion here. And finally, we conclude, you see, in conclusion, uh, uh, conclusion and abstract are two similar thing, but we need to use uh, some different wording. I told many times, uh, look my past sentence, people here write summary sometime in conclusion, I put here, uh, if you don't write in conclusion, it doesn't mean just start SNO2 multiforous nanofiber were synthesized by electro spinning and implied is a protonode in disensitized solar cell. It is very clear sentence that when people read this, they will say Kamar Wali have synthesized this particle and they use uh, this uh, material is a protonode and disensitized solar cell. You see here, in further I say pure or pristine tenoxide shows lower performance, this efficiency. How we improve that? When we incorporate titanium nanoparticle and we made a composite structure. You see, this is a very, very clear message in this conclusion. Conclusion should be very, very clear. If audience are not supposed to read my whole paper and they read only and only my conclusion, they can get the idea. This is the main rationale behind writing conclusion. If the audience do not have time to read my whole paper and they just want to read my abstract, they can get the whole idea of my paper. If the audience do not have time to read my whole paper, they can get the idea from introduction. Introduction must be a, uh, the way which give uh, a separate meaning. At the end of the introduction, uh, you have to write that how you achieve and what you achieve. This was the general overview. In the coming videos, I will thoroughly discuss one one by one uh, section. Thanks for watching.